Hello everyone and welcome to CenterStack. CenterStack is a managed file sync and share solution and in this video I'm going to show you how an administrator can enable data at rest encryption feature. Tenants who would like to ensure that their data is secured and also encrypted in cloud storage can take advantage of our data at rest inscription feature. Dare makes sure that the data gets encrypted on clients and then gets stored in the cloud storage in encrypted form as well. This ensures that no one other than the tenant and its user will be able to read the contents of the file from the cloud storage. I'm going to go into my management console and show you that I have a tenant created who does not have the Dare inscription enabled. So I'm going to go ahead and select my cluster manager. And I'm going to show you from Tenants Manager, I have a tenant, which is Adam here. And Dare is Dare inscription is not enabled, so I'm going to go ahead and take you into the server. And this is our CenterStack server, so I'm going to go ahead and show you the files for this tenant. And I'm going to go ahead and select this log file. And as you could see, we are able to read it. It is in plain text. It is not encrypted because their inscription was not enabled for this tenant. So I'm going to go ahead and go back into my web portal. And I'm going to go ahead and create a new tenant with their inscription enabled. So I'm going to go ahead and select Add Tenant. And here you need to enter the tenant administrator information. I've already entered it. And I'm going to go ahead and click Continue. Under Tenant Administrative Control is where the option you see Show Data Address Inscription Configuration page and it requires an empty storage container. So I'm going to go ahead and enable it and click Continue. And here you will select the tenant storage. And as you can see, our tenant has been created. I'm going to log in as this tenant from another browser. And this is where you will enable Data Address Inscription. And I'm going to go ahead and check the box. And it says, if data address inscription is checked, your data will be stored in an encrypted form using a key derived from the password specified below. Enabling this option may reduce the performance of upload and downloads. You cannot mix plain text files and encrypted files in your account. Please specify the encryption password below and save it in a safe place in case you need to recover encrypted files while setting up a new account. So you will need to enter create a password and save that password in a safe place. I'm going to go ahead and create a password and then re-enter that password and click on apply. Since this is a new tenant, you get this option to take a tour or skip the tour. I'm going to skip the tour. And here I'm going to go ahead and just upload some files. And I'm going to show you this file here, which is the same file I used for the tenant before I showed you. This is the file and I'm going to go ahead and go into the center stack server to show you when I select this tenant now. I'm going to go ahead and look for that tenant and I'm going to select the same file and as you could see the file is encrypted. It is not in plain text and it is unreadable because their inscription was enabled for this tenant. I'm going to go ahead and go back into my web portal and this is how it an admin can enable their inscription in center stack. Thank you.